welcome to Yen's Yoga. We are here at Ellery's Park of Sydney in Australia. Today's flow is an upper body yoga workout designed to alleviate upper back pain and muscle cramps. Through the poses focusing on our shoulders, upper back and arms, it will build strength and improve posture, prevent future discomfort. This flow will encourage stability, flexibility and relief in the upper back. See you when you're ready. We're gonna begin today in a cross leg position. Inhale, both hands rise. Exhale, we cross our hand and fold forward. Uttita Sukhasana, arm crossed. You should feel the stretch on your upper back. Breathe a strong scapula as we aim to root down our sit bone and both elbows noticing which leg and hand is in front of you inhale release exhale we cross the other hand as we fold forward Uttita Sukhasana Uncross is an amazing practice to calm the mind release any tensions in the spine or neck and back from corporates working, best worker, or traveling. Couple more breath here. Just enjoying the stretch. When you're ready, meet me with your shoulders in line with your wrist in a kneeling position. Left hand behind your head, inhale up, enjoy the twist, options to widen your leg, right hand is rooting down, as you twist towards the left, Parivirta Balasana, awesome guys, push your hand and send your hip bone high to Aramukha Svanasana. Next exhale, right hand reach the outer side of your left ankle. If you can't reach, maybe walk your feet closer. Parivirta Arumukha Svanasana. A great contract of a tricep as we strengthening the elbows. Left hand are spreading wide as we rooting and pushing the floor away. Beautiful guys. Next inhale, right leg to the sky. Exhale in the middle of your mat. Place your palms in front of you on your hips. See if your hand is horizontal to square your hips. Back feet is 45 degrees facing the side of your mat. Your hands are bound behind you. Exhale, we fall forward. Paraswatan Asana Yoga Mudra. Invitations to use your block or straps. You shall feel a deep stretch on your right hamstring. Bring your right hip back. And maybe head towards your straight leg. To square your hips. Pull your right kneecaps. Well done guys, find your balance rooting down your right leg as we floating the left leg towards the sky. Hands can be continued in your yoga mudra binding together or like me at the side of your body. Bada Dekasana Breathe softly to remain in balance as much as possible. You want to compress the front leg and bring your left leg high. When you have enough, right leg flossing towards the left side using your left hand to grab your bottom chest outward as the twisting towards the left. Atita Tarasana Options to dip your hip slightly lower if within your practice. 
keep your shoulders broad and open when you inhale. Well done, guys. Make your right leg outside of your right hand and drop your left knee. Point your back feet. Inhale, lift your back feet. Opposite arm going to reach on the outside of your back feet. Our aim here is to twist and bring our chest front facing to stretch our right arm. Parivirta Anjanasana with our chest front facing. Left hand on the ground to support you. Exhale, we release. Let's do a vinyasa flow. Inhale here, exhale, bend your elbow. Inhale, chest up, Urva Mukha Svanasana. Exhale, push the floor away, Adho Mukha Svanasana. Let's take a pause here. Regulate your breath. You shall feel your right hamstring is stretched and your right shoulders are much stronger. Right leg is using a lot of strength and stability as to balancing on the pulses. Option to pedal your feet or bring your navels in and arch your back when you're ready let's do the other side bring your walk your feet closer exhale left hand reach the outside of your right ankle Arivirta Aramukha Svanasana the extended knee are activating the quads this stretch is relaxing the hamstring you might feel more flex, uh, flexibility on the right hamstring. Inhale, left leg to the sky. Exhale in the middle of your mat. This time, straighten your left leg. Hand on your hips to see if they are horizontal. Hand behind you as we bow forward. Karaswatan Asana Yoga Mudra Your right feet is 45 degrees side facing Left leg are straight and pull your kneecaps as you enjoy the stretch on your left hamstring Gaze back See if you are in the middle of your mat <laughs> This pose helps with a better range of motions of our hips and shoulders Ground your left leg, find your balance, and float your right leg to the sky. Bara de Kasana. This balancing pose is a great way to establish mindfulness for working professionals, sportsmen, and teenagers. Your arms can be at the side just like me. Ground your hand, bring your right feet facing the long side of your mat, left leg flossing towards the right as you twist towards the right side. Patita Tarasana. Left hand is grounded, right hand facing the sky. The chest is open as you inhale. Option to dip your hip. If it is within your practice, strong hip, feel the adductor of your left inner thigh. Next inhale, pop your right leg, sorry, left leg outside of your left hand. Drop your right knee. Opposite arm, gonna reach your right outer edge of the right feet. Again, I want you to twist, not to the side but facing the front of your mat. Options to use the block underneath your right hand. 
I help you front facing. Arrivederta Anjayanasana. You should feel the stretch on your left shoulders. Upper more breath here. Beautiful guys, let's facing the long end of our mat. Knees wide, toes, big toes together. As we twisting towards the left, I'm mirroring you. Both shoulders are stacked. Shoulders in line with your hips. If you feel the stretch on the left. I think on the right, you shall feel the stretch on your bottom arms. And our right psoas. Arivirta prasarita balasana dui hasta. Let's switch side, this time facing the right. Your hips are externally rotate. Shoulder blades on and outwards flexions to create a good stretch at our mid back and upper back. As much as possible, just stack your shoulders, left cheekbones resting onto the earth. Shoulders in line with your hips. Let's bring ourselves lying on the back for Chakrasana. Feet are in line, knees are in line with your hips, palm is facing you. As we push the floor away, send your hip high, squeeze your glutes to protect your back. Active armpit and push the floor away in Chakrasana a great counterpose or internally rotate well then guys let's hug our knees in Pava Mukhasana shaking side to side massaging our back if you feel called to do anything else you are most welcome to do now Otherwise, meet me in Shavasana. I will call you when it is time. Gently bring awareness to your body, moving your fingers, toes, give yourself a good stretch. When you're ready, meet me in a sitting position. No rush. Inhale, both hands rise to the sky. Exhale, we bow. Thank you everyone who practiced with me and choosing Gen Yoga. I'm so happy to meet you here again. Please give me a like and comment down below to let me know how you feel. I can't wait to see you on the next video.